remember actually the, the first time I, I had ever heard of that thing when I was, I think it was 12 or 13. And uh, one of my brother's uh, friends were visiting, and he played guitar. And uh, so we, we went down to the, to the basement where we had the little music, music studio with the guitars and drum kit and everything. And he picked up, picked up the guitar. And, and I was uh, just like, and this was uh, around the time when I joined a, a local band called Weed. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I, I'm, I'm not sure we, we knew what it was. So, and it was a pretty serious band. It was, uh, uh, it was uh, drums, keyboard, guitar bass and saxophone and the keyboard player he sang uh, and uh, he was the band leader in here he, he wrote down all the music for us so everyone got the uh, uh, sheet music uh, and we played a lot of Beatles songs and he arranged everything so I had to read the, all my lines uh, and then he had one song that was a little bit more hard rock and then I went back home and I wrote the tapping solo. And he was like, oh my god, you, you play exactly like Ingrid Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> and I mean, the, basically, the, the, the standard you can just do that, but on more than, than one string. Or, or, or string skip or whatever. Also for me, it's uh, when I play tapping stuff, uh, I, I, I want for one of the hands to be to do pretty much the same shape, and the other hand can move around. Because if you have to, I mean, if, if you could have a independent eyes, so you could watch both hands, that would be awesome. Uh, so sometimes I like to have the, the same uh, frets that I tap on. Then I can move my left hand. So, because otherwise, uh, as soon as I have to change positions with my right hand at the same time, it's not going to happen. Have <laughs> you use more than one finger of your right hand for tapping? Uh, sometimes, but not not a lot. I so rarely do it, sometimes I do like that. Like that. But uh, I, I can't, you know, toss away the pick and be like... Some people they, they bend like uh, for for a uh, semi semi note, and uh, even though I have light strings, I can't do it uh, because I'm I'm so afraid that I'm gonna break a string. Because you have some light strings. Yeah, but I, I can bend the whole note, but that's it. That's that's it, and that makes me a little bit. I rather can do it. That's why I slide so much between notes and positions. Well, sometimes uh, you can just play any, you know, like any scale, but you just omit every other string.
the uh, Alan Holdsworth uh, experience of inspiration. Switch between playing over the, the A the A triangle. 